Bombshell is a biographical drama and is based upon the accounts of various women at Fox News who aim to expose CEO Roger Ailes for varying incidences of sexual harassment while at the network station. The film stars Charlie Theron, Nicole Kidman, Margot Robbie and John Lithgow and was directed by Jay Roach who is known for directing films like the Austin Power film series Meet the Parents and its sequel Meet the Fockers. It was written by Charles Randolph who previously wrote the biographical comedy drama The Big Short. Right or wrong I went into Bombshell with practically a blank slate about the real life scandal. I might have taken it the wrong way but to me the trailer didn't really give a good representation of the final product. It gave the impression of a comedy drama so it sort of put me off seeing it. There aren't any comedic moments except for some humorous banter here and there but it is a serious film. So glad I went to see it though. Putting the accuracies and inaccuracies aside because of course I couldn't say what was and what wasn't on both fronts, I found the film to be very engaging and involving. The performances are so good in this film, so much so that I couldn't help but believe what the characters are going through, and I think the acting rises above Jay Roach's direction as well, even though he does a good job at balancing everything. Margot Robbie shows so much range and emotion in this film, for example when her character Caleb Pospisil, which is an accumulation of various real life people, is in Roger Isle's office where he asks us to do something horribly inappropriate. It is very uncomfortable to watch and Robbie's performance handles it perfectly. John Lithgow as Roger Isles is brilliant in the film. Lithgow gives a very convincing performance, an eerie one to be honest, and his character shockingly believes that it is his right to be able to do these things to women, especially because he is in a position of such high power and feared that nobody would question him. Charlie Theron to me is one of Hollywood's best actors around today and is great in all the roles she undertakes and this one is no exception. She plays Megan Kelly who at the time was one of the most popular anchors commentators at Fox. You really do feel for Megan as she is torn between going against Isles and the idea that her success and abuse are interwoven. Nicole Kidman is also very good in her role of Gretchen Carlson. There is not so much, if any at all, conflicting points of view for her character. She portrays a very determined, strong woman who wants justice. Not just for her but for other victims at Fox News at the time and through past years. All the supporting casts are fine in their roles also. Some of the most powerful moments in the film are when certain characters say to others why didn't you stand up for me and the ones where you can feel the poison in the air so to speak. That people can be divided and or penalised for standing up what they believe to be right and when people feel they can't speak out because of the culture they're in is designed to stop them from doing so. The film style you could say almost satirises the infotaining side of working at a place like Fox News. Everything is snappy, fast paced and the info is given to you like bullet points at the beginning of the film to bring you up to speed, which could be a pain for some but I was fine with it. The film's called Bombshell not just because of the revelations that unfold throughout, but that there is a pun on the film's behalf that people, especially women, are moulded into a certain type due to the kind of environment they work in. The film's events are set during the time of the candidacy, when coming up to the presidential race. I think the film really shows a side or background story of how Trump had the same beliefs and opinions as Fox News right wing views, and he used that media at the time and probably still does. My final thoughts on Bombshell is that it gives us an insightful look into behind the scenes of a hard and unforgiving career life working in that kind of media. The script is very good and sharp from Charles Randolph. The way it tackles the main theme of the film is done in a smart and convincing way and the acting is first rate from every one of the lead actors and they are easily the driving force of the film. This film is definitely a must see. Well thanks for watching guys and if you are new to my channel welcome. I hope you enjoyed my review of Bombshell. Please do tell me your thoughts on the film down below in the comments section and don't forget to click subscribe and all in the notification options so you'll be kept up to date with my latest reviews. Thanks very much guys and I'll catch you next time.